We can simulate the pulsing of the wheel with magnets and coils. In our prototypes, we have 60 magnets mounted on a rotating wheel. We have 15 coils fixed in position, and we have one sensor for control. When the magnet passes next to the control, current will be passed through the coil to repel the magnets. That provides the pulse force. Out of the 15 coils, 10 are drive coils, 5 are collector coils. We can measure the input energy, which is the energy supplied to the coil. We can also measure the output energy, which is the energy extracted by the collector coils. In one of the experiments, the input voltage is 0 0.8 volt. The input current is 1.5 m, giving an input power of 1.2 watts. The output voltage is 12 volt. The output current is 0.33 amp, given an output power of 3.96 watts. The coefficient of performance is equal to ratio of output energy over input energy. In this case, it is equal to 3.3. This means, if we supply one unit of energy, we can get 3.3 units of energy out. The result verifies the lead out energy theory.